Okay, so CJ So Cool had recently had did a video about the home invasion that occurred and him getting shot for a time. Now, there's a couple of things that I'm kind of confused and I'm trying to figure out. But in the video, CJ said that the guys had broken into his home, went straight upstairs, busted down the door from his bedroom, and they put the flashlight in his face. Now, he thought that it was the cops coming in, I guess, looking for somebody. But when they started shooting at him, he realized it wasn't the cop. CJ So Cool had did an interview with one of the news reporters, and he was explaining what was going on. Now, in that report, he was saying that when they went in with the gun and they pointed the gun at him, he was holding one of the um, robber's gun and then was holding the other robber gun at the same time and they were shooting at him. Now, remind y'all, he got shot four times in his leg and he said he was fighting, but I'm kind of confused because if he was holding both guns and they were shooting at him, don't y'all think other parts of his body would have been shot as well? Now, the other confusing part that was going on in this whole scenario about his video and also the news report video. Now, the news report also stated that the people that robbed CJ had went through a window, then went straight upstairs. Now, in the video, CJ stated that they broke in the garage. Now that part right there, I'm kind of confused. Was it the garage or was it the window that they went in? Now, another thing that I'm confused about because um, Leslie was talking to the news reporter and in the news reporter, she stated that CJ had texted her for a time. She didn't answer none of his texts because she said that she was sleeping, but then he called her and that's when she picked up the phone and found out what was going on. Now, that's what she said in a news report. Now, CJ had went and said that when he called Leslie, Leslie was very fast and picked up the phone and then said that he never answered her phone but you can tell that kind of you know pushed leslie button because she was kind of upset that um cj so cool had mentioned royalty and said that she didn't answer the phone and she trying to make it seem like royalty could never do nothing but i understand she's a little jealous of the relationship that cj so cool and royalty had so maybe she feeling some type of way thinking that cj is gonna wind up going back to royalty who knows but anyways um royalty also had did a video and in the video she says that she never said cj so cool of that people that are making up these rumors are all lie and they are messing with her life because now people are sending death threats to her and also her kids now that right there is kind of wrong for people to assume that she was the one that set up cj so cool and even trying to you know send death threats to her kids and to her nobody don't deserve that whether they broke up in bad terms Nobody does not know exactly what occurred in the robbery and trying to point fingers at everybody. Oh, at the end of the day, nobody don't deserve this. Um, the people that are getting accused and have false rumors should not be going through what they're going through. So hopefully at the end of the day, CJ gets his justice and, you know, really find out what really occurred. Now, it's kind of confusing to me because cj does says one thing in a video and then in a news report he says something different and when he said that lexi picked up the phone fast she goes and says another different story in the news so it's kind of like you know confusing to me don't need nobody to come for me saying that i'm trying to say that he's faking his whole situation and stuff like that no i'm not trying to say that only thing is i'm trying to say is it's kind of confusing what he's saying he says one thing and then he goes says a different story and it's you know it's kind of confusing but at the end of the day i'm glad that he's doing okay and he's recovering and hopefully they'll find out you know what actually really occurs so um guys comment down below and let me know how you feel about this whole situation and i'll catch y'all next time with a brand new video bye